So my parents are white people from Maine. They moved to Massachusetts because they thought they were rebellious. Well, I moved to Harlem because I thought I was bootylicious. <laughs> yeah, big ass, right? Oh, yeah, it was fun there. So whenever I go back visiting Boston, I am amazed, admiring, I respect the letter R. Everyone says, ah, pack, you ca. I don't know, Staten Island has its own way of saying an R. R is a beautiful letter, R. <laughs> Being from Massachusetts, the Commonwealth of Massachusetts, I try to be sort of political. It's, it's important for me to keep the Kennedy spirit alive. It used to mean having sex and alcohol with many. These days, it's a little rough. You're supposed to abstain from alcohol or be in recovery, and I'm only gonna have sex with liberal Democrats who are going to vote. You know, it's desperate times, so I gotta do what I can. <laughs> so, whenever I go to Massachusetts, it's usually for an event, like a wedding. Oh, I'm so tired of going to weddings, because somebody's always gonna have to ask me, Connie, when is your wedding? When is it, girl? And I always have to say, well, why do I need a special day to have sex with a married man? I mean, what world are you living in, people? <laughs> okay, I'm single. I had an online dating experience, but it ended very sadly. Yeah, the guy had a heart attack. His wife found his browser history. Okay, stupid. <sighs> so I moved to New York to pursue my desire to be an actress. So here I am in Staten Island doing comedy. I know, what a world, right? So after a while, you, you gotta audition. You gotta be out there auditioning and it's relentless and hey, I disappoint a lot of people because no, I'm not Susan Sarandon. <laughs> but I do lie a lot to go to auditions. I mean, I've had a mammogram 20 times in the past three months. I'm okay, I'm really okay. <laughs> and uh, dear Nana has died five times already. You gotta lie to get out there. You gotta be in it to win it, I guess, right? <laughs> and sometimes it's really <laughs> stressful auditioning, you know? It's like they're, they're in the room, they're staring you down, and somebody whispers, she can't act her way out of a paper bag. <laughs> well, excuse me, but if I am in a paper bag, I think I'm gonna really do some acting, because first, I'm gonna figure out, oh my God, I'm in a paper bag. What am I doing in a paper bag? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm squished up against Chinese takeout containers. <laughs> and what if, oh my God, it's stapled, and it's on its way to apartment 14C. Okay, thank you, thank you. <laughs> I'll be here all night. <laughs> I'm not a doctor, but I play one on TV. I rewrote it. I'm not an actress, but I pay enough union dues to play on TV. <laughs> Thank you, Saga. <laughs> Things are not that bad for me. I'm on camera a lot. I'm on camera daily. Yeah, surveillance cameras are everywhere. <laughs> Careful what you do in Times Square. There's like jumbotrons now. <sighs> New York is fantastic. And I recently partic participated in a marathon and I'm only now recovering. It was kind of grueling. I mean, I was exhausted. Yeah, 26.5 hours visiting my mother. <laughs> Slop through, yeah! Oh my God, she's old. She's a really nice lady, but she's old. This Easter, her idea of a resurrection was actually getting up and out of her recliner. Oh, <laughs> love the lady. Uh, an egg hunt for her was trying to remember names. Like mine. I know she called me Jane. It's fine, Mama. Love ya. Mwah. Like old ladies are like bunnies. They're fuzzy. They're cute, and they're best contained in cages. I mean condos. <laughs> her mind runs and runs and runs and runs, but not her legs. So I worry. What if she falls? What if I push her? <laughs> because of her, I'm not facing another birthday. Not again, ever. The thing that's worrying me is my fake age is getting old. <sighs> okay, I'll, I'll, more on that later, but I, I just wanna say, I gave up my Catholicism this year for Lent, and it was the most rewarding thing I could do. I'm totally liberated. Before I did, I went into confession and I said, bless me, Father, it's been a while since I've had sex with a young boy. How you. <laughs> He's still saying those Hail Marys. Yeah, thank you. Bye. <laughs>